Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm going to be discussing today a product that I tried recently that I didn't really like as much as I was hoping to like. It's not a makeup product. It's not, um, I guess it's kind of a skincare product. It is the Fizz and Bubble Bowl Bath Candies Tropical Fruit. And this is what I will be discussing today. I have to say I wanted to do this video because I wanted to do a review on it. I had already planned on doing a review on something a little different and I had thought why not the bubble baths that I've kept in my my little storage bin for quite a while. I purchased these at Ulta and so I was really excited when I bought them. I was excited to try to finally try it out. I hadn't done a bubble bath in a while and so I thought I would try these and I was disappointed when I did. So the directions say break apart these hard bubble bath hard bubble bath candies under running warm water starting with just one candy for a rich fluffy bubble bath or go crazy and add more for an insane amount of bubbles. First of all, I don't didn't like that I had to actually break these under running water. If that water gets too hot, you're going to burn your hand. And you're kind of testing the waters, obviously, to see what your temp is for your bath that you like, you know, water-wise, temperature-wise. But if you're not careful and you're just starting that out, that water builds up super quick depending on what, how it flows through uh, your pipes or whatever. I get, what I'm trying to say is sometimes water goes from like 0 to 100 really really fast in terms of warming up and so that's why sometimes you can get in the shower quickly and sometimes you still gotta wait a minute. Um, so I'm not trying to burn my hand. And then second of all, so I already had to break this apart. I couldn't just throw it in because that's what I did. I threw the first one in and it didn't work. And maybe that's on me. Maybe that was my fault. I didn't really read the directions before doing it. I just thought that it was like any other uh, bath bomb where you kind of just throw it in the tub and it, it'll, it starts to bubble up. It starts to give you that color. So maybe that was on me. But here's the thing. I did another one. I did a second one. And I haven't even shown you guys. My bad. What they look like. Okay. Because the pro to this is they look super cute. They're individually wrapped little candies. Um, and they're super cute. They're pink. And they smell good in the container. They actually do smell good. But it was just disappointing because I did another one. And this one I broke under the running water. Once I had gotten my temp all set out. And it still didn't do anything. Wow, what did I get on my glasses? Did I just get a random smudge? I feel like I just got already as much. Sorry, guys. Just gonna wipe it off on my t-shirt. You know, no big deal. We know how it is for those of us that wear glasses, right? Right, right? Yeah. Um, what was I saying? Oh, so I did a second one, and I got nothing. I didn't get any bubbles, which if you had, you know, which it says for a... Oh my goodness, the fine print, like this is so tiny lettering that I have to write it. Rich, fluffy bubble bath. There were no bubbles. No bubbles. Maybe two or three. It wasn't like it gave your tub this nice bubbly feeling. It wasn't like it gave your tub this color to it. I would have thought that with the pink, there might have been hints of pink. But no, it just looks like murky water. I wanted to experience a nice bubble bath and I got murky water looking bath and no bubbles. I don't like that. Don't tell me that it's going to be rich and fluffy and not deliver on that. Um, especially because I, it was just disappointing because... Disappointing, not disappoint. Okay. It was just disappointing because I had wanted something more. I had been expecting more and I didn't get it. I didn't get it at all and you know, it's it stinks because it's nice. They look nice, they smell good. That's another thing. It didn't smell like it smells in this container. I just fit, sorry. It didn't smell in the tub the way like it does in this container. Here you get that tropical fruit smell. Once it's in the bath, I don't know what it smelled like, but I know it did not smell tropical or fruity. It just didn't do that for me either. So it kind of, 
it, it even says right here, simply crumble under running water. Well, you know, like I said, that was my fault for not reading the instructions properly, but it just disappointed me. And um, I don't know if I will repurchase something from this brand. I know I won't be repurchasing these for sure, um, which stinks because, like I said, it's cute packaging and everything is nice in there. But um, in terms of, like, uh, actual bath bombs or something like that, maybe I might reconsider because that's a little bit different than what this is. <clears throat> Sorry guys, I seem to be having some uh, issues here. Um, but I do not, re I wouldn't recommend this to somebody unless they're searching for something that's uh, kind of like that, kind of like not really bubbly and not really like colory, just something that's nice and relaxing and is going to do that. But I don't necessarily know about recommending this. Um, but yeah guys, that's kind of my review of this. It was, I was just disappointed. I had hoped for more and I didn't get the experience. I didn't get that nice experience that I had wanted from it and um, yeah, that's all I have to say on this. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you guys in my next video. Also, don't forget to follow on the other sites. I've got Twitter, I've got Tumblr got Insta. I don't really post a lot on that Insta because I tend to have my personal uh, Instagram account on my phone rather than my um, more YouTube and brand um, uh, account, I guess, on there, which I probably should kind of switch it up a little bit. But yeah, I'm on Poshmark as well. Feel free to follow me there. And um, yeah, I will see you guys next time. Bye.